clean. Uh-huh. What did you say? What was their name again? Keen. K E E N. It's the the Valve version of dwarves, basically. The Keen folk. Then the mid lane, you don't have to worry about it. Yeah, it looks pretty okay. Has a salve to fall back on after the homing missile hits him as well. Donked on the head. What's Rubik doing? Oh, they're getting a kill on Lich. Look at that. Clockwork traps him inside the cogs. FY chased him back. Oh, top lane. Top X lane. Over, about to drop. Does get behind the tree line, though, and Charles continues to fight with Yang pressing the attack. PYW has a carapace and stick charges to fall back, but PYW still holding carapace for the longest time. Doesn't get it in onto the whirling axis of Chalice. They turn, they battle, and Oracle falls, but the trade off. Oh, he dies to neutrals. Oh. Chalice doesn't get the kill. Well, at least it's something. They got caught uh, in a really bad spot. Meanwhile, in the bottom lane, you probably... Has double Wraith Band, has just bought a bottle up. Wastes the charge as he walks under the rocket barrage of maybe. And I've missed the kill on Rubik down bottom. Whoopsie doopsie. Being down towards bottom rune, but there's a Lich here as well. They sandwich in the Gyrocopter. One versus three. Nowhere to run, and Gyrocopter's going to fall. Give it to Eurus. Give it to the Morphling. Beautiful. Grabs it up on Paparazzi. Homing missile is going. Lift up, will drag back, but the Sinister Gaze holds the gyro in place. You're not getting this kill. It is pretty rough here. Ori still has 15 one charges. You are absolutely not taking down the DP. And in comes the Nyx with a stun onto two. Beautifully done by PYW. Now Summon is in so much trouble, but the chase isn't there. They cannot follow through. Vici Gaming just have to reset. Pull back a little bit, maybe turn on to FY now, who has stuck around for a little bit too long, to be honest with you. Another impale will catch out the Rubik, and even with the Fortune's End and a few little burst bits and bobs here, they get the takedown on DY, and Somnus turns to fight. He's almost level 6, kill the creep, kill the range creep, anything, just get him level 6, PYW, burst down, X and over with the two points in Purifying Flame, beautiful nuke damage, and a double kill for maybe that seemed impossible. Okay, he's not quite anyway, but now there is. He's walked back into danger. He's overstepped yet again. Schrodinger's 11. You don't know quite whether he's going to do exceptionally well or exceptionally poorly. This Legion Commander will become a core. Fortune's There's end. no real burst damage. All right, type it up, Gary. What's happening? Nyx has died. Ah! They've got a catapult here to push off the back off as well. Yeah, this is what oh, I just for... talked about. God's sake, Chalice. He's going to drop here for sure. He's got eight one charges, but bottom lane will grab DY at the same time. So they do get themselves a couple of good kills there, Vici Gaming. Camp, which is not that bad. Oh, X Noah TP'd. Very risky. He gets an Observer Ward down, but that's going to be his dying move. He's hidden in the trees. He hasn't been seen. Oh, Ori has walked past and they haven't seen him. No way. His ex Nova found himself a tiny little hidey hole. <laughs> he went, oh, they, they, oh, they know, they know, him. they, they know. Him. Cut the tree, kill the Oracle. We found you. It's Easter. Hiding Oracles in the trees. Oh yeah, Lich Court again. DY being burst down. They do get the kill. Old Levin is going to be helped out a little bit by Somnus, but with Ori and Eurus both here, not really too much he can do, but fall away. Another defusal blade as well. Gyrocopter well on his way towards it. Role playing as Topson as a duel. Is that stolen? That's Rubik's duel. Hello. They don't get the win, but Yang should be a kill regardless as the purifying flames, the burst damage is good and kills off Legion. But Eurus, very tanky with a small fling and still holding onto the Ghost Scepter now as Rubik skirting around, dodging, juking through the trees. Oh, he Stolen steals Vendetta. You sneaky, sneaky boy. But Gyrocopter needs the false oh, promise from done. the Oracle. The save is up and X Nova has the heels to pump through with one charge. He can keep on going and they can potentially fight. Old Levin's killed off PYW. X Nova sniping kills left and right. Okay, Old Levin will finally fall, but it's well worth it. The pushback down to the low ground. FY still invis in that Vendetta. On cooldown for that Rubik. Needs another spell to steal, but he's going to get picked off here. Pretty tanky, Rubik. Oh, he's, has he already strength morphed up? He has. So that save from Oracle will keep FY alive. Another turn, the steal of the Chain Frost. It won't. Oh, he bounces back frost. on the catapult. The green Chain Frost kills him off. And a sick hook shot. Push back with the cogs. The Legion Commander getting found out by Chalice. Now the troll battle trance. In we go. On to Yang. Down you go. Sit down, Legion Commander. LGD strike. Three kills in a row. Any dual damage? I didn't mean to have zero. Yeah, it's, it's pretty rough for Yang, and it might become a little rougher. 
Chalice. Oh, Disarm. Not amazing there. They try and keep the heals going onto the troll wall, and it will still gather them a kill as they catch a stun, killing Clock. Inside the cogs? No, maybe not. The False Promise will save him up. An old Levin, old shot forward. Still has the aggressive potential. Onto the next assassin we go. PYW helped with the shield of frost and the chain frost bouncing back in onto the Oracle. X Nova, are you baiting? What are you doing, buddy? Hiding in the Roche pit, still gonna fall. Eurus with a double kill. Two for one exchange, but no Roshan taking capability, and exorcism is used with no objectives claimed. Why? There's nothing uh, to block. And Oracle has like a million spells to pop your Lincolns from long range. Oh, well, that's an insta kill, isn't it? The jump, they, yeah, they've, they've, they've got plenty of catch. Stun, dual. And with the E-Blade Adaptive Strike, not even going to bother using the E-Blade, honestly. Just get the winner over onto Yang. So first dual win of the game for Legion at long last. <laughs> I was being mean, and I love you, Gary. So. Get some lands one day. I mean, no one's getting any lands anymore. Bloody hell. Chain Frost's up. They're catching Gyro. It's pretty quick and easy onto Somnus. No backup available. Oracle still a good 2,000 range away, 3,000 range away from that. Run and the road space straight away. Pushing, but Exorcism... And Morphling doing so much physical damage, shredding through Roshan. He's nearly dead, but the clock works in. Old Eleven looking for the steal. Roshan's still up and running. The Yules up into the air will allow them to get the Aegis onto the Morphling now. And Old Eleven trapped inside the cogs yet again, forcing the save with the heels of Exnova. But Chalice, he wants to battle. The BKB from Ori will give him a bit of safety as they reset. And LGD forced to hold their own high ground. So another victory for Vici Gaming, just losing a lich. Stop the Morphling from actually getting off Morph. Are these single target cast spells? Like here, they've got Hookshot. They don't have the follow through quite there. And Yang will retreat back to the high ground and Troll forced to BKB as Vici Gaming bring numbers middle. I don't know if LGD can actually battle this. Old Levin's kind of been left by his squad to uh, fend for himself. And in jumps Eurus, turns into Clockwork. Battery Assault forward, not going to be able to catch the clock. The fight, like a meat shield. He's got no more uh, no more utilization, really. Yang getting picked off here by LGD. Good little snipe onto the Legion Commander. And this slows down Vici Gaming, slows down this Aegis that they're holding on Eurus still. Another double damage for Gyro on top of Hastrun, but he's dropping low. Schrodinger's 11, he's gone in, and he's gone in too deep. He's got nothing done. The tip from DY, okay. yeah, well deserved. FY now, maybe in a spot of bother himself. Four staff forward, what's he gonna steal? Gets a stun out from the next assassin, so we'll be able to turn and run as the tier one finally crumbles and LGD get the objective which they've been waiting 25 minutes for. Or back in the shop as Nick's assassin gets picked off top. A help shot. Hello. Who we jumped on? Legion Commander was lurking around in the shadows. But LGD are really here and they're not messing around, are they? Two quick kills in succession. And Morphling has just got to shift down towards bottom lane. So Vici Gaming spread too thin. Yeah. Clockwork frontlining real hard. Old Eleven doing old Eleven things. If they use an exorcism to kill the clockwork, I think he's all right. A dual win for Legion Commanders, maybe a, a little too far, but now the chase is off. They cannot continue forward, and Ori has used that long cooldown ulti. <laughs> this is exactly what Eleven does when they're in a bad spot. If he's on a winning side, he starts to play over aggressively. FY's in. They made the jump. Yang gets caught, but a nice two-man impale on the carapace as well. Stolen back by FY and the BKB's forced. Moving on to Yang still, as that E-Blade helped to keep him alive a little longer, but Chalice is so powerful. Ripping through this. Poor little DP with the bashes coming out, but the Battle Trance has left him isolated. Stranded out on his own. And Euros is hunting yet again for more targets. Into gyro mode. X Nova. Do they have a stun? They do. Push back with the adaptive strike and a beyond godlike streak continuing here. He was also not doing great, so he, he can't needed that board. Yeah, BKB. he needed an item to fight. Catching out old Levin and another dual win. We we went from no dual wins in the first what 15 minutes or something. I got Somnus gonna get scouted out here. Pyw trying to line up an initiation. And maybe he's stuck sentry. around just a little too long. Stun, nice sidestep, dodge away, but they've got the heroes they need. Troll going for Satanic. That's not going to win them the game. It might prolong things, but there's Heaven's Halberd. There is Nyx Assassin, Sinister Gaze, Yule Scepter, Shotgun. So he, he, I think he needs to go all in on the damage. 
Gyro's going for one. Daedalus. That might be the big one. And LGD heavily reliant on the Oracle save onto Troll and Gyro especially. As Chalice jumped on by the Blink, Shiver, Silence, Duel, everything. The Kitchen Sink oh, thrown nice. in onto the center. Troll. Beautifully done so there was no save from Xnova. And it should be a bonus kill with the E-Blade of Eurus. Kill the Courier as well. Why, why not? Ori takes it. And that was a gem on Courier, hey? Waveform forward, Eurus, aggressive, but the Cogs, they do nothing! Oh, poor Eleven! Forced out of his base. They reclaim the gem with another Courier, but this, this one, I don't know, it looks all but over. If they don't want to go for a, another full lane. Smoke up in yeah, behind them, Fountain Titan. Range Raxes as well. Why the hell not? That's been pretty ridiculous. Nyx Assassin yet again makes the first move. Good combination into chain stun. That Rubik, long range impale, and Old Levin still up and running. Gets the saves out with the Fate Edict and the heal. Chalice going to work on DY. So, a one for one so far, and still battling forward, but the Battle Trans disarm, and now the duel in from Yang. Poor Troll, he's down in the dumps, and it looks like he's about to be brought out, as there's no false promise anymore. He's got it on him still. And that's him gone. Buyback available. He's going to be forced to use it. And a second lane of barracks for Vici Gaming. Nothing to stop them whatsoever. Troll is still holding buyback. You're saying it's do or die, but it looks like they're just dying and not really doing too much doing. Holding out for something. Maybe baiting, pretending he doesn't have buyback, forcing Vici Gaming into a position where, you know, they take down tier fours, but they're not falling for any traps. And there we have the buyback from Troll, but Vici Gaming have already very quickly expedited their retreat from that dire base. You can almost fully complete it up. But here come the TPs. There's a the catch. FY, two-man stun again. Just so beautiful with ease and a hook shot. Landing onto Lich, but Odd 11 can't continue forward. And they've got a duel onto a prime target in the back. It's the troll, and that's him without buyback. Poor Oracle being defeated by the Exorcism Ghost, and Eurus is just cleaning up house now. LGD, they are done for. Three in a row. Four in a row. I missed the fourth one in the back somewhere. It's X Nova. Down and out, and it's tier four into ancient time. Group wave top should be able to meet up on the high ground, and they can bring down the final buildings in this dire base. They're still not calling it. I, I guess they're having fun, Gyro. Mayday! And there it is. They just wanted to share the grave that they dig for themselves. With this position three clockwork. <laughs> yeah, it was a rough one. But, you know, the draft, we had like seven offlane heroes banned. We get to the final heroes and it's like, well, crap, what do we have left?